Welcome back to the channel everyone, it is the baddest man on the planet, the human juggernaut himself, Damien McLeod. Now listen, listen people, we're gonna, we're gonna dig in deep, we're gonna dig in deep. Now, this video here, we're at the part of the video, I'm not gonna play any of this guy's video because we already know he's gonna cry foul. Now, this is the part in the video where Jason Blaha says, he calls him out, he goes, look, if you can do a 225 overhead press, then do it. Do it. No finessing the people. Well, I'm saying that. Don't, right, listen, listen. He, like, like I said in a few videos ago, if you haven't watched the videos I made previously on this, you need to watch it. Trust me, you will have a new found understanding on what Alpha Destiny is as a person when it comes to the fitness industry and his finessing, you know, finessing, if you guys aren't, you know, up on game on what finessing means, it means pretty much, you know, swindling, allegedly, I'll say that, the community with his lies. You know what I'm saying? We, we've already exposed a bit of racism in what he was saying, a bit of, um, I'll we'll call it, you know, it was, it was a lot of shit that he was saying, but we're gonna skip past that. We're gonna fast forward, hit the button, <laughs> Now we're here with the 225-pound press. <laughs> I know you guys hate me. I know you do. I know you do. But anyway, listen. We're here with this 225-pound press. Now, he is claiming that his memory card was corrupted. Now, I've seen YouTuber after YouTuber explain, hey, my memory card was broken, right? Which means they lose the whole clip. They don't lose part of the clip. They don't just conveniently save a part where it's at the top of the lift. Now, like I said in previous videos, once you say one lie, you have to keep on lying over and over and over again to cover every single lie that you keep telling. His memory card didn't corrupt. It simply, it was, it was a finesse. It was a high level finesse. That's what it was, all right? If you can do that lift, with your yoked training, that's just this amazing training that no one's ever thought of, you know, that's a style of all of your own. If this yoked training is really what it seems, and all that money you've collected from all these people from your yoked training and your, your pamphlets, your online pamphlets that just, you know, come on, do it. We want the world, we want to see you do it. You know, this nether beast guy, he's a fraud. You know what I'm saying? He's a fraud. I'm pretty sure he, he allegedly may not even be natty, allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. So, you know, listen, the, the, the exposure's here, people. The exposure's right here. It's in everyone's face. The last couple of days, so like even earlier today, I seen a video where he, he, he pretty much came out trying to, you know, he's explaining. You know, he's trying to, oh, the truth about the situation. No, he comes out, oh yeah, I used to be, I used to be a, a, a loser. He, this is, these are his words. I used to be a loser, so I was on forums doing a bunch of stuff. Uh, no, 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 no. Not everyone's on forums using the N-word. You know what I'm saying? Being a misogynist, saying all these things about women and you, and you pulling out your private parts and all kind of weird shit you were saying, man. That's who you are. This online persona that you put on the YouTube with your with your um Rogaine beard, you know what I'm saying? That that's an act. That's not who you are. Who you are is that person we saw on the forum. Now earlier today I saw some YouTube troll, you know, some fanboy came by, he's trying to make excuses. Well, you know, a person can change. You know, no, a person can't change. You know what I'm saying? You are what you always are. Now you might have bad habits that you might give up on. You might have been a smoker in your teens and then you kind of got into your 20s and you say, you know what, I think I want to stop smoking. That's changing, but your personality type, the actions you do as a person, no, no one changes. You are what you are. You're either a douchebag or a scumbag or a nice person. All right? And nice people don't go around the internet calling people the N-word and talking about how they'll pull out their junk and how they control women and all this crazy, sh you know, it's a lot of shit. And I'll say allegedly because, you know, even though it's been confirmed it was him, you know, just for legal purposes, you never know, say allegedly because, you know, allegedly. But come on, people. No one changes. And like I said, do the lift. Let's get back to the lift. Do the lift. I know I go around the world with these things. That's, that's what makes this channel so fucking interesting. All right? Do the lift. You have Blaha here, the fake Merc, 
This guy sits on the internet and says he trained at the farm at Langley when there is no fucking farm in Langley. <laughs> and he's calling you out. How can you be called out by the, by the Lord of Fraudulence himself that's calling you out for being a fraud? I was saying the other day, is, I made the video, is his career over? Is Alpha Destiny's career over? And you, like, you, know, you had a few guys come on my channel and they're saying, yeah, it might be. Some guys say, no, it's not over. Listen, it's not over completely because there's always going to be fanboys. Two days, three days, four days into the exposure, there's still people coming around my channel splaining and fanboying. So you're always going to have these, these, uh, these huggers, <laughs> for lack of a better word, I'm leaving out these uh, huggers coming around fanboying for you, splaining for you. Just like he got on there, made a 30 something minute video splaining. You know what I'm saying? It was just, it was, I, honestly, I swear, I haven't lied about anything on this channel yet. I promise you, I got about three minutes, in, not even three minutes into that video and I turned it off. I heard everything I needed to hear within the first 60 seconds. And I was pretty much done. I would no longer, I don't even think I hit two minutes, the two minute mark on that video and I turned that shit off. Because it was bull crap. Every time someone gets called out on something, just like that chick Tana Maganu, when she was acting racist and saying all that stuff she was saying, she got called out and then she comes on with her mega jump cut video. I'm so sorry. I'm so. All these jump cuts and shit. Fraudulent. You get caught out. I'm not that type of person. I've changed. No, you're not. That's what you did because that's who you are. You finesse the people in the fitness industry because that's who you are. You know what I'm saying? It's been clear cut. It's not like I'm up here throwing out false allegations. You've been caught and exposed. Now, Blaha is here, Mr. Lord faking this himself. He's calling you out. He's calling you out. <laughs> Are you going to do it? I'm calling you out. I want to see. I want to see you do it. You claim you can do something. You're, you're making money off of this program. You're making money. Cha ching ching, green paper. You use it to buy shit. You're making this off of people who believe in you. Yet you give them a, a corrupt video story or your, your car was corrupted. I've, I've fucked up my memory card a few times. You know what I'm saying? Because sometimes you get like static shock when you walk around too much and you're holding your car. You can statically shock your shit and you can mess it up and this has the format. Which means, excuse me, I almost burped. Which means you lose everything on the card. I've never once had a corruption situation where part of the video is there, but the other part end isn't. It's called a data file, a data stream. It's compiled into five to 10 gigabyte, um, you know, blocks. It doesn't just conveniently go in and say, you know, well, I'm gonna corrupt, uh, I think I'm gonna corrupt right about here at the beginning of the lift. That's where I'm gonna pick my corruption. And people fall for that? People fall for that? Come on, kids. You're better than that. What are you doing? <laughs> oh my God. The fitness industry needs a reboot. It needs a serious reboot. Like today. God. This is one of the videos where I should have had my camera on me because you can see my, my reactions right now. It's like a reaction video. Like I'm literally one centimeter away from my, my microphone right now going ape shit because this is ridiculous it's like the fakest stuff goes on in this fitness industry it's ridiculous down from the photoshop to the steroid allegations of oh, just these people they're ridiculous and at the same time they're making a shitload of money because they're playing on the minds of the foolish ones out there who believe they're natty who believe a guy who can um, bench press 225 for 20-something uh, reps plus is natural? They believe that shit. They believe you can get on the bench press. The most I've hit it so far, when I was really, really deep into it, which I'm getting back into now that my shoulder is feeling a lot better, I hit like 14 reps with the 225. And that was actually at the end of a solid workout. I'm a pretty strong motherfucker with no steroids. 
but I don't care how strong I was. I wasn't hitting out 25, 26, 27, 30 fucking reps. Unless I was juicing like Jack LaLanne. <laughs> but anyway, you know, like I said, you know, I, w I would really like to see this guy stop all the splaining, do like blah ha 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 said, get your camera, no camera cuts, no fancy angles, no strobe lights, no nothing extra. You can do your little <clears throat> grunting thing you do before you lift and just lift the shit. You got a home Jimmy said, lift the shit. Just lift it, upload it. We want to see it. No fancy jump cuts, no camera angle switches. Just turn on your camera raw and just do it. Just do it. Prove the people wrong. If you prove the people wrong, then hey, you can overhead press 225. But that doesn't take away from the fraudulent shit that you've been exposed about. That still doesn't clear that. Let's, let's get that straight now. If you were to man up and be alpha and accept the challenge of a man, be a Spartan, a man, and say, I stand up, head up, chest out, and say, I accept your challenge, Blaha and McLeod, Damien McLeod, the Alpha Wolf, the baddest man on the planet. I accept your challenge. I'll do it. Then I'll do it. And then prove us wrong. But that does not excuse you. You are already exposed anyway. So I'm going to go ahead and end the video right here, right now, people. Ah, this is crazy. This is crazy. The fitness industry needs a reboot. So, with all that said, get to the gym. Oh, I forgot my other part, huh? <laughs> I hope you liked the video, people. And if you did like it, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. I am subliminally in your mind. So until next time, get to the gym, do work, and muscle up. My adversaries cry like hoes, fully eradicate my foes. My lyrics explode on contact, came in you hoes. Who else but mama's only son? But the phony niggas in the world say my name, watch bitches come. Now